welcome back to my Let's Play for Pokemon Silver and my final fighting run. And I have to admit, I'm mostly doing this for my own benefit right now because it's like 90 something degrees outside, so since I really don't want to suffer while playing PS2 games, I figured I'd work on, you know, some Pokemon Let's Plays, work on some other handhelds, maybe work on some RPG Maker games, that sort of stuff, you know. Just so I don't have to sit in my room while it's like 90 degrees. Because it's not just me that has to suffer, it's my mice that have to suffer with me. Yeah, you know, all five of them are still in their bin cages. So they were fighting a bit um, yesterday or the day before because I put new food in there. And Black Beauty seems really partial to certain food items, I guess. So she throws up a bit of a ruckus with the others if they touch certain food stuffs. She's like, they're mine! All mine! So she starts pushing them a bit, you know? It's not super violent, it's just, you know, have a bit of a disagreement of opinion there on who gets what food, so gotta start pushing a bit and chasing them around the cage you know and generally being annoying yeah black is probably the most aggressive of the mouthers when it comes to you know who gets what food um, I don't think she usually wins though I mean she's picking on the biggest you know mouse I have the oldest one I'm like you ain't probably gonna be able to beat her she's just gonna carry it and then eat it oh no Nah, I call for mom. She bought more stuff with my money? That's awful. Okay, let's get going on through the ice cave. Do I have any repels on hand? Can't remember if I do or not. Don't. If I don't, I'm just gonna get hit with a bunch of random encounters. I can live with it. And did I teach anyone strength? Huh. Well, if not, I can always just give it to somebody. It's not like it'd be a terrible move to have or anything. Okay. I think I mostly got this down. Yeah. Okay, let's see. This way, this way. Um. There we go. Boom. Because I really need this HM, you know, for later. Because <laughs> if I don't have it, I'll be screwed. A bit surprised I haven't been hit by somebody yet, to be honest. <laughs> I guess they're avoiding me. Weird. Though I probably should try and work on something besides muscle at the moment. Though I'm probably gonna rely on, um, Bruce to carry us through the battles ahead. I'm not sure if that's a great plan or not. We'll see. Oh, it's Deli Bird! A rare find! It's too bad I just want to kill it. Tell you, bird, you're useless to me. So, you know what? Eat some fists. And by fists, I mean feet. <laughs> well, at least he has some decent experience, I suppose. It's too pat's not worth anything else. Oh, uh, yeah, I gotta teach someone strength. Okay. Let's see. Yep. Let's see, let's teach strength to a Pokemon. Now, which Pokemon should I teach it to? Um... Muscle. Now, let's see... Yeah. Now, what should I get rid of? Um... I think... I'll chuck Seismic Toss. Mainly because Seismic Toss does set damage. And there's very few opponents I'd go up against where that'd be really helpful. Since strength will work on most opponents and can take advantage at least of Muscle's attack stat. So yeah, we're gonna just chuck Seismic Toss and go for strength. You know, just try and overpower some Psychics later. I'll be we may be too slow to make that work, but we'll see. Okay, I need to move that boulder that way, and this one needs to go up. I gotta set that one up in advance, after all. Now, let's see. Huh, we're gonna wanna go down, yeah. Huh, and... Oh, darn, it got caught. At least I didn't push it too far, so I'm gonna have to go down to fix it. Huh. Well, now, is this thing gonna do an endure? Yeah, figures. 
Swine Ops, um, Swine Ops horribly predictable. Loves using Endure. Just to annoy me, I swear. It's like, I can endure your hit, no matter how powerful they are. And it'll usually try and stack them, too. <sighs> Thankfully, that usually doesn't work out, because they get less, um, reliable the more times you do it in a row, but gosh darn, is that annoying. Like, I just want to beat you and move on. Like, you're not even worth that much experience, my nub. You're kind of worthless for that. Okay. I went too far again. Oh, well, I can fix it. Maybe I'll get lucky in this one will actually try to attack me. Nope. You know, instead of trying to set yourself up to endure hits, you better off trying to throw your weight around a little bit. It's too bad I can't break this with a two-hit technique, right? Well, it's a bit late to try anything now. You're already dead. Jeez. Well, let's go and push the rock. And we're good. Those should be the only two we really need to get in place in order to get out of here. I mean, the others can help me get some items and stuff, but I don't care about that. Hmm. A jinx, eh? Smoochum's arguably better. After all, Smoochum learns, you know, psychic and confusion. Well, Jinx is like, I get Blizzard! <laughs> like, great, you get a move with 70% accuracy, and your baby form gets psychic, you know, one of the most powerful psychic moves out there. That's a great trade off. <sighs> well, let's grab the full heal and move on. At least with these random encounters, it makes sense why, you know, I usually bring the repel right because it's adding so much more time onto this. Oh, great! It's a Golbat. Well, I guess I can always headbutt it. Probably gonna want to go back and pick up Thunder Punch too, knowing my luck. Really, that's that's your go-to move right now, Leech Life. Like you don't know Wing Attack, so you're so you're gonna use a Bug move to bug me. Just, just a little bit, you know? Don't want to bug me too much, or I'll be inclined to kill you even harder, right? <sighs> Jeez. That was a waste of my time. Well, I'll take you over about ice with me. Of course, the main reason to bring Thunder Punch along is probably going to be for, um, all the, um, people that are going to have, you know, Horses and Cedras and, um, Claire's Gym. They get in the way. Oh, jeez. Um, headbutt again. I mean, Jinx has got a real glass jaw, so... I'm not expecting it to survive it, you know? Just, just get out of my way. Give me the experience and go away, Jinx. That's just rest, I don't care. I'm not running a rest talk set, after all. I'm not doing curse lax. Or that thing would actually come in handy. Tarn it. Threw myself backwards on accident. Like, I want that iron. I needs it. Well, needs it might be a strong um, phrase there, but I wants it. Well, let's take ourselves some PP up, and I'll think about what to do with it later. I'm sure I can throw it on some move somewhere, and it'll help me out. Well, that does it for this episode. Next time, you know, we're going to take on a budding dragon mistress and see who's stronger. Bruce Lee or a dragon. Until then, see ya.